is a simple stretching routine that you can do with your workouts this month. You can choose to do all of the stretches or pick just a few to do depending on how much time you have available. First one, let's start with a hip flexor stretch. You're going to come up onto your knees, bring one leg in front. Now before you even start this stretch, tuck the pelvis under. You should already start to feel a stretch in the back leg, the back hip flexor. Now start to lean forward into the front leg. When you feel that stretch, bring the same arm as the back leg to the outside of the front knee. Let's add in a rotation. Rotate as much as you can. Now you can stay here or if you want to go even deeper into the stretch, pick up the back leg and try to pull the heel in towards the glute. Again, if you just want to stay here, that's totally fine. Hold the stretch for about 10, maybe 20 seconds, depending on how much time you have. Okay, and then we gently release. Bring both hands to the floor. Sit back on the back heel. Try to extend the front leg. Keep the lower back nice and flat. Now try to bring the chest down towards the front leg. Think of bringing the chin and the chest to the ankle. Again, just hold here. Gently come up, and then we'll switch. Always make sure you do both sides. Bring that front leg forward, tip the pelvis under, feel that stretch in the back leg already. Now lean into the front leg, getting right into that back hip flexor. Same arm as the back leg, bring to the outside of the front knee, add in the rotation. Again, you can stay here, or if you wanna add on, Pick up that back leg. A little balance challenge too. Go ahead, gently relax. Bring both hands to the floor. Extend the front leg. Make the back flat here. Exhale. Bring the chest down as much as you can. Think of chest and chin towards the ankle. Good. All right, from here, let's come down into a seated position. Legs come out straight, just a little wider than hip width, doesn't have to be too wide. We sit up nice and tall, arms to the side. Inhale, rotate as far as you can, and then exhale, reach the little finger to the little toe. Each exhale, try to go a little bit deeper into the stretch, and then we'll inhale, roll through the spine, come back to the center, other side. Inhale, rotate, exhale, and reach. Keep both hips on the floor here. You want to try to lift one, but make sure you keep both hips down. Inhale, come back to the center. You can repeat the sides as many times as you like. Next stretch, we're going to bend the front leg and bend the back leg so it looks like this. This is one of my favorite stretches. Let's go towards the front leg first. Come down to the elbow. Big stretch. Try to reach the hand away from the head as much as you can. Hold here for as long as you like. Then inhale, lift up. Top hand comes onto the back shin and we'll reach other direction. This side, you're not gonna be able to go very far, but you should still feel an awesome stretch all the way up the side. Inhale, come back. Again, you can repeat if you want, and if not, switch. We'll go same thing on the other side. Lean towards the front leg first. Arm comes overhead, stretch the hand away from the head as much as you can. Inhale, lift up, top hand to the back shin, and reach other direction. I love this stretch. It is awesome. Good, and come up. Last one we have, come down onto your back. Another great one for the glutes this time. Cross one foot over the knee. Reach through, grab behind the knee, and just exhale, pull in as much as you can. You can use the elbow to push this top knee out to get even more of a stretch. So just hold here. Each exhale, try to pull a little bit closer into the chest. Now we'll add on, bring the top foot down, take the arms wide, 
Exhale, rotate across the body. Foot comes to the floor and just let everything drop. Keep both shoulders on the ground here. This one, you should feel lower back and the outside of the top hip. This is another of my favorite stretches. It feels so good. Good, inhale, come back to the center. Same thing, other side, cross the leg, reach through, pull in. This bent loop is the one that we're stretching. Loop of the bent leg, I should say. Again, use the elbow to push out on that knee for even more of a stretch. And then bring the top foot to the ground, take the arms wide, exhale, rotate across the body, foot comes to the floor, and let everything drop. You can even take the front arm, apply some pressure on the knee to get more into the stretch as well. Good, gently come out of the stretch, inhale, come back to the center, and there you go. You can do all of these stretches or just choose a few to do after your workouts. Hold 10 to 20 seconds depending on how much time you have.